Well, hello, it's Tom and Callum, and welcome to Soft Talk ASMR. How are you today? How are you today, Callum? Today is a very special day. Today is the making of the one year anniversary video of Soft Talk ASMR. Yep, 18th of December 2019 was the first anniversary. Thank you to all the subscribers. Thank you for being here. Thank you for allowing me to have an audience. That's great. It's interesting, Callum's laying down. Um, his head away from the camera. <laughs> Carry on. Do you have a look round this way? Look, what's this? some stillness, find a chance to relax and really let go, allow yourself to joyfully release the past. To find stillness, it was really something that I'd never really truly found one year ago. To find that beauty, that feeling of bliss, serenity, to melt into at any given opportunity that I can do it now. 
can find stillness and so can you. The gentle approach to life. To find yourself being softer, calmer. Really softening the edges of everything that you do. Because you don't need to resist, you don't need to rush. Always take an opportunity every day to melt into just being, just being you. Just melt into it now. Really just let go now. Joyfully release. Let go. Melt into where you are. Feel the earth energy connecting with you. Let it glide you softly and gently forward. Because we must all keep going forward. beauty. Be kind to yourself. Be kind to others. Be kind and gentle. And accept. Accept to make change. Allow yourself to accept what is going on so that you can then find yourself no longer resisting but being in a higher vibration to allow yourself to rise above it all and you can co-create change the inner beauty within you, which you all have. Allow that change, that positive change and intent to create now. My hands are glowing warm. I really feel that lovely warmth. Hello, Cameron. Hello. Hello, Cameron. Let's sit this side. You might be able to see Cameron a bit better. There we are. Cameron, would you like to sit up here? There you go. This is an abalone shell, abalone shell. That beautiful rainbow ray, healing, full of healing. Delicate and gentle, delicate and gentle.
softly spoken and gentle, 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 gentle. Sticky tripod. Now you've probably noticed over here. Huh? Hello, Archangel Metatron. Hello. Now, if you viewed the video. It was filmed on Saturday night, just gone. You would have seen the painting progress of this particular painting, Archangel Metatron. And do you remember in the video I said about a healing ball of light? Well, like all these things, sometimes it, things tend to change. I found myself painting a quite a sort of whitish area and I thought, do you know what? Archangel Metatron is the keeper of the Akashic Records. So I've painted the Akashic Record book. There. And then there's the rainbow ray. Red for your root chakra, orange for your sacral chakra, yellow for your solar plexus chakra, green for your heart chakra, blue for your throat chakra, indigo for your third eye ajna chakra, and violet for the crown chakra and there's brilliant white light shining beneath How I discovered Archangel Metatron was thanks to Carl Gray with his Angel Prayers Oracle cards. When I first got them, the card that I was shuffling that always came out 
several times to begin with was Archangel Metatron. So I looked into and researched Archangel Metatron. And I've got a book here. This is Carl Gray, Angel Prayers book. And on page 110, it talks about Archangel Metatron. Now the main reason why I linked up with Archangel Metatron and his energy is because it talks about indigo warriors and a huge influx of indigos arrived in the 1980s and 1990s and I was born in the 1980s. Carl Gray says, I call these amazing souls indigo warriors because most of them are adults now. They are natural born psychics I've been told many times that I am one of them. Many of these souls choose families that needed to be reminded what love was. So they came to broken homes, to low and lost parents, or were adopted. They are highly sensitive. They can go from being corn collected to, it says destructive, I wouldn't say I'm destructive, but I can change at the flick of a switch, I can get unsettled. Many of them have been labelled with autism or OCD. If you don't know already, I am autistic. I've never mentioned that in the video, but you may have wondered, you may have possibly considered that. I'm very sensitive, I'm autistic and I'm in a world, in a society that has yet to learn and allow fully sensitive selves, people who are different. I'd like to think I'm here to help make that difference with the help and encouragement and association of others doing similar efforts like this. Um, going back to Carl Gray's words, if the souls can remember their divine origins, as these are the indigo souls, which I believe I am one of, however they can be become powerful psychics, leaders and peace entrepreneurs. They can spot liars in an instant. And although they might not be, although they might be hot headed, generally they have every reason to be. One of the greatest things about the indigo generation is that it has a passion for truth and integrity. Indigos will share this with you. Hence why I've made this channel. Eh? Sadly, many indigos have lost their way in life. But Archangel Metatron can help get them back on track. If you know someone with indigo qualities, send Metatron to them now. And so the indigo ray, the indigo warriors are embodied by the indigo ray. As you know, in my pocket, where is it? That's oh, over here. I always have this close to me. It's an indigo crystal called lepidolite. Lepidolite. L-E-P-I-D-O-L-I-T-E. And this crystal works really well with the Ajna Chakra, the third eye. 
Um, the indigo ray is protected by Archangel Metatron and the indigo angels who will respond to our request to connect. We can also visualize ourselves being immersed in an indigo light. This will enable us to awaken our inner psychic abilities and strengthen our assertiveness. guess being spiritual those of you who are on the spiritual path can relate to what I'm saying and this has come to the fore a very helpful very friendly guy on YouTube called Tim Walter if you search Tim Walter T-I-M W-A-L T-E-R He's written a book called Spirit and Earth with Adrian Inkle, Inkle and Weber. This book. And in this book, Tim and Adrian talk about a protection exercise to help us really expand our auras to bring in divine healing light and for ourselves as co-creators to project our own light as we manifest further with our spiritual paths on our journeys and I did a drawing of what I've read did this drawing beginning of the month then I've simply called it light worker and the aim of this is to protect ourselves when we work with divine energy, spiritual help by breathing in and breathing out and projecting cleansing and protection with the colours of breathing in red and expanding out red that's for our root chakra and then breathing in orange and expanding out orange for our sacral chakra and and so on you're breathing in yellow for the solar plexus and green for the heart and blue for the throat and indigo for the third eye and violet on the periphery for the crown and then the book describes about encouraging the intent of bringing silver light gold light and white light in I admit I don't do this every day, but I do this most, most days. I hope this is helpful to you. Something to consider, to think about, to help yourselves and help your loved ones. Expanding, bringing light into your life and into the lives of others. Positive intent, positive healing light, progressing forward expanding, expanding forward. Same applies here, you see. The, as we most likely all know, a rainbow is effectively white light. It's a spectrum of seven main colours coming through thinking about my first video I was sat just there and it was just before Christmas yeah, week, ten days before Christmas. It was a Saturday night. I put on a smart shirt. And I felt I just wanted to put myself 
out there to create, to be, to be a creator. And we're all creators in our own right. Whatever we do, we create. We co-create, don't we? And that first video, which to this day hasn't had many views, possibly only one or two likes, but it doesn't matter, was the start was the building block of change, of bringing in that intent of change which I clearly knew I needed to do. Callum, would you like to come over this way? He says, no thank you, I'm quite happy sleeping down here. You see, and there he is, Callum. <laughs> okay, so I've put the little microphone on. Callum's going to do some eating sounds. On the subject of whilst you're on the subject of self help and healing, this has been a real massive, huge help to me. It's the Twin Hearts Meditation for Psychological Health that has really helped me. It's basically projecting out all the stuff that is you, is keeping you stuck and 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 holding you back, projecting it out as love and inviting in light, pure healing light. It really works. I highly recommend it. Twin Hearts. Twin Hearts Meditation. And if you get the psychological one, it's on iPhone and Android, so you can get it as an app. It's quite quite cheap as well, the, the apps. Shall we pick a card? Shall we, shall we go to the Angel Prayers card? Pick a card and see. See what comes out. That was the Archangel Raphael that came out um, in the last Oracle card reading I did. So let's do a little bit of shuffling. Move your body. Move your body. Thank you, angels, for motivating me to move my body and energy. There we are. It's all about energy. Everything is about energy. So express yourself with movement. I've been out. We've been out. We've done a lovely walk today, haven't we, Callum? And whilst we're here, I'll show the Archangel Metatron card. The one that started all this off. <laughs> there it is. Clear your vibes, Archangel Metatron. Thank you, Metatron, for clearing my energy field. And there he is. Oh, and look. Next to it was this one, Mother, Divine Mother, Mother Mary, unconditional love. Thank you, Divine Mother, for helping me to give and receive the love I deserve. There we are. Thank you once again for your love, for all your kind comments. One year anniversary video. I hope you enjoyed it. Callum. Callum. 
as ever with loving kindness. I shall talk to you soon. Keep doing what you're doing. Keep striving forward. And thank you. Take care.